we're on strike because the government has said it's going to impose a contract on us. Um, the contract is unfair for doctors, um, especially damaging uh, to female doctors. Um, it's unsafe for the NHS. Morale is is pretty good despite the terrible weather. Um, but uh, I think we can see that you know, we're still concerted and uh, still keep keep fighting. Yeah. And um, you're seeing that the, that the next strike it's going to be an escalation um, and without emergency cover from junior doctors. Are you? Is that something that concerns you? Um, that's correct. So the next strike will be uh, a full withdrawal of junior doctor labour um, from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. on two consecutive days. Um, it is an escalation. Um, it is going to cause significant disruption to the hospitals. But however, um, junior doctors are not the only doctors in hospitals. Um, there are consultants, there are other associate specialist doctors, um, and we've given a significant amount of warning to two hospitals to plan for this. Um, it's possible that by cancelling elective work, uh, by ensuring that they've rostered enough consultants on the reserves uh, and hospitals can continue to provide safe care, um, but it will cause significant disruption of elective services. Okay, um... And finally, um, tomorrow, uh, Manchester Trade Unions are, are urging uh, other unions and local people to support the junior doctors. Uh, what can other trade unions and uh, local people do to support you in your fight? Um, there are numerous petitions online on the site of junior doctors. Um, and ultimately, this is a battle that is going to be won through exerting enough political pressure. So, people writing to their MPs, people speaking to their MPs, um, coming to our demonstrations, coming to our marches, 